Alrighty guys, what's going on? Welcome on back. We are Baskies. Enemy, let's prepare for our next battle. Who's hurt? Just make Leo. I mean, make Leo's the only one. Genius staff. Wish I could add to that. Our attack could probably go up by two. But it would add to it and make it better. Uh, which way do I have to go? Spin that right. Shh. People! More like... Someone who could wield their powers even within Zenris's domain must have led humans and Hellions into this place. Heldolf! Maybe he was trying to get the humans to destroy the seal so he could get to Camlon. I don't know about that. Remember, he's linked up with Mautelis. He could probably cut through that seal like butter. Yeah. No doubt Heldolf is already camped out at Camlon, waiting for us. This is likely just his way of tormenting me. Well then, if we waste any more time here, we're just falling into his trap. Then let's press on to Elysia. Pretty obvious what Kitty Beard is after. Yes, corrupting Saray with malevolence, I take it. Saray's aware of it. You can tell he's trying his best to keep it together, despite the circumstances. Ugh, screw you, Smeldolf! No one can keep their head on straight when their friends and family are in mortal danger. Who knows what evils he may be plotting in order to cause Saray further heartache. I can hazard a few guesses. We gotta stop him, no matter what. Let's go. Wait, that's... Oh, 
shit. Alright, let's go save before we fight that monster. We must be getting close, ladies and germs. Do we have time to face this monster? Oh, we're not that far into it. I'm still... That looks like fire and water. Darn it! A powerful Hellion like this right at Alicia's gate! Saray! Yeah! Take this one out! All right. Ooh, wow. Resistance, fire, water, wind. So earth. Earth would probably be the best scenario. We barely got shit. Thousand XP, baby. Saray, let's hurry. Right. You, baby. Actually, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I thought that was gonna be a horrible fight. But they usually give you easier fights before the big boss fight. So let's go ahead and save in the same spot. It looks like a battlefield. They must have become Hellions, losing themselves and turning on each other. How could this happen? It's possible they simply had the same thought that Heldolf also had back in the day. Alicia and Camlon are strategically valuable, right? But the war is practically over already! Which goes to show you how much some morons don't want it to end. Yeah, but they're not the only ones responsible for this. There's massive amounts of malevolence pouring out from somewhere. Probably a sign that the seal my mother forged has been broken. Gramps, everyone, please be safe. I was gonna say, I bet you Gramps is a hellion.
Some we are level 50. Something's wrong. Yeah. All these bodies of Highland soldiers. But no sign of the people who live here. Ow! It's a barrier. It must be something Zenra set up to prevent humans from breaking in. Gramps! It's me, Saray! Saray? Saray, you're back! Yes, thank goodness! Saray! Oh, thank goodness. I'm so glad you're all okay. Where's Gramps? He told us to wait here. He said that he was going to go drive out the humans. He went out alone in all this malevolence? I'm sorry. We should have been there with him. But even if we had, we would only have gotten in his way. We left him out there to die. Hey, like Lila keeps saying, reflection good, regrets bad. There's no way Gramps would fall so easily. Saray. I'll go find him. Kaim, everybody, stay right here. If everyone else was safe, Gramps must be too. Where's the gate of the dawn of chaos that Gramps headed towards? Ah, he's trying to save you for the little shit shows up. We can no longer tell how you will respond. And so, as you can see, we determined this to be the only remaining option available to us. You did this? Whatever plots you hatch, it doesn't matter. I already have my answer. Do you hate me then? Do you wish to plunge that sword into my breast? Where is Gramps, Simone? He went to the Gate of the Dawn of Chaos to drive away the Earth Dwellers flooding in. Though it's far too late at this point to do anything. Like our dear purple petunia is worried. Saray has most likely grown a lot stronger than she anticipated. Yeah, she knows that no matter what she does, Saray will brush it right off. It's got her quivering in her dainty little shoes. But a cornered dog is likely to bite. If it comes down to her last resort, do you think Saray can really just brush it off? It worries me. Well, we just won't let it get to that. Simple enough, right? Yes. He shouldn't have to know how it feels. Not even if he thinks he's ready for it. Edna. Looks like our Edna's in serious mode. Looks like our Zavid's pretty serious mode himself. For once. That's a good thing, Zavid. Please make serious mode your default from now on. Oh, I can't refuse the request of such a pretty lady. Just watch, I'll be serious. We in love. Hey, you married? Would you like to be? Lila, you idiot. He would have stayed that way if you had just left him alone. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. Speaking of which, does he have fashion? I, I kind of like that theory cat. Not even gonna lie. Yo, he looks fucking dashing, don't he? Hell yeah, we're going with that. I'll fucking look good. Does she have another?
Heading, uh, where are we heading? On the way. Uh, I guess that's the ruins, right? To the ruins. So I, I think that's the way we're going. Not really sure. I really don't have a way to know because it doesn't tell you. <laughs> I, I really don't know if we're going the right way or not. I don't think that's the way. I am lost now. This is not good. I am loached. We're wasting precious time. I'm trying to find this aroma. Where to go?
towards the ruins. Okay, maybe we were. I was, there's was just no. Oh, what? Serai, isn't that? I, Zenris, shall record the truth regarding the birth of the human Serai and the Seraph Miklio here in writing. That's Gramps' handwriting. Both Serai and Miklio are survivors, survivors of Camlon, the, the origin, origin village, village where the age of chaos unfolded. Miklio's mother is Muse, the younger sister of the late shepherd, Michael. Serai's mother is Selene, a citizen of Camlon. I have been entrusted to the care of both of them by Muse, who managed to escape from Camlon. I closed off Elysia with my domain, and decided to raise both of them in an isolated place, separate from the outside world. As long as I live, I swear to protect these young babes as part of our family. It's the same memory that Maven showed me. Yeah, so that would make it right after Mautelis became a Hellion. Lila, isn't that around the same time that you first met Zenris? I see. So that would mean Gramps told her of the incident in Camlon and the start of the Age of Chaos. And so she earned the power to purify through the Oath and waited until the Shepherd appeared. I didn't know of their names back then. Is there anything else mentioned in their Saray? I pray that these children, burdened with the tribulations of the era, shall still live in peace. But if... Saray? But if these children, children should challenge, challenge their, their fate, fate and, and desire to create a new world, world then may, may they receive the blessings of both humans, humans and, and serve them alike, so that, so that their, their will, will for a new future, future may be fulfilled. So Gramps knew all along. He did. So they said the ruins, so we will go back to the ruins. Can, can I actually walk to the ruins? Where, where are we at? What's it called? Ruins. There must be herbs around here. The fuck is that? Okay. An angel? Holy shit, sixty nine? Uh, why is there an angel here? Hmm. As far as I know, this one looks more like an angel to me. So, is it really a Hellion? It is indeed, and it possesses powerful abilities. They can reflect non-elemental attacks with great probability. We just got our ass beat. Reflect back, and with great... 69? Probability? The cold nature is so charming. Let's have fun. Earthlord, break Burst! Break down! We have a thing. Go forth! Chase the water! Is this my all? Ah, you, you got our ass beat pretty hard. Yeah. Find a way I can. I mean, she was only 14 level. I mean, 14 level. That's a We got ass beat. I am so lost and so confused. Um. Shit, I don't know where to go, son. I really 
don't know where to go. I'm, phys I'm physically lost. It doesn't even, I mean, it really doesn't tell you where to go. both of those and level that up. Magic dropped a shit ton. beautiful explorer poet named Maven? What is going on? I don't know, but now I'm curious. Curious times a hundred. I've got an imitator. I don't know what to do, guys. I really, really don't know what to do. <sighs> Might as well just call it here. It looks like it's time anyways. And, uh, uh, no, I'll need to find what I need to do. Because <laughs> I really don't. I'm lost. Alright, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And stay tuned. Hopefully, I can figure out what the heck's going on. Till next time.